welcome to its topic in today's video i am discussing the question bank questions of chapter 4 the chapter name is introduction to loops at first uh, there are mcq questions we will discuss the mcq questions then we will move to the short answers the first question choose a right statement the statements are loop loops or repetition repetition block executes a group of statement repeatedly it is true loops usually execute as long as the condition met it is also true loops usually take advantages of loop counter it is also true so the correct answer is all of the above number two loops in c language are implemented using while block for block do while block all of the above then number three while loop is faster in C language for or which loop is faster in C language for while or do while actually all the loops are same only their format is different all the loop use same techniques to repeat the statements like counter initialization condition so all the loop are same just it's depend at what uh, what type of program we are writing then number five while loop is guaranteed to execute at least one time or which loop is guaranteed to execute at least one time it will be do while loop then number six which of the following statement about for loop is true index value is retained outside the loop index value can be changed from within the loop go to can be used i think all of them please uh, write the correct answer in comment section i have confused only with number b statement number seven answer the following in true and false number one if the condition of the while loop is false the control comes to the second statement inside the loop it is false because what happened inside the loop whatever statements are there if it is false nothing will execute not that first statement second statement if it is false it will directly exit from the loop we can use at most three loops it is true the statement inside a do while loop execute at least once even if the condition is false it is true only first statement inside do while loop is execute when condition is false it is also false last one in a do while loop the condition is written at the end of the loop it is true now come to the short questions the first question how many types of loop are there in c programming there are three types of loop do do while and for loop number two what is the while loop give an example a while loop can execute as long as the condition is true the condition of the while loop is checked at beginning and you can give this example means the syntax you can write while condition then statement number three what is do while loop a do while loop can execute at least once even if the condition is false the condition of the while loop is uh, do while loop is checked at the at the end then what is for loop <coughs> a for loop is used when we know the number of iteration in a loop means how many times we have to run the loop if we know then we can use a for loop then number five name three portion of a for loop they are initialization expression condition checking and update expression number six why do we use loop in a program i think it is from book only we use loop in a program to repeat a set of instruction for specific number of time specific number of times loop make our program shorter and easy to understand understand <laughs> then then the remaining questions uh, 7 8 9 it is directly given from the book so i have already solved uh, solved the exercise questions you can see from there i will give the video link in comment section and description from there you can check it then long question number 1 
long question number one explain do while loop with example we can write the explanation like that a do while loop can execute at least once even if the condition is false the condition of the loop is checked at the end when we want to execute the set of statement at least once irrespective of the condition and further execution is depend on condition at that time we can use do while loop and for example you can write a program by using do while loop i have written a here a simple program which will display the hello for four times then explain for loop with example a for loop is used when we know the number of iteration in a loop a for loop has three portion initialization expression condition checking and update expression we write all the expression together in a for loop and separate by using a semicolon. For example, I am here writing a simple program by using for loop. Like uh, this program will display hello for four times. Here I have just, and you may notice here I have written void instead of int. As I have written void, so my program will return nothing. That's why I have not written the return part. If you are writing the return type of the function is void then you should not mention the return part and the programming exercise whatever given here this all are given exactly same as from book as I have already solved the question so you can go through the book and if you want uh, don't have question bank and you want to get the questions you can go to my telegram channel my telegram channel name is it's Rafiq from there you can download the pictures of the question bank and from there you can follow the questions and this uh, programming practice if you didn't understand any program you can write in comment section I will explain it again in simple word so that uh, it will be easier for you in next video we will discuss about nested loop in C programming chapter 5 for today's video this much only thank you for watching see you in a new video till then take care and bye